Ms. Ferg. Go on, Ferg. Uh, we'll start the questions off with Lauren Rosen. Hey, Ferg. Two 20 point perf performances in a row. How good does it feel to be performing on this level consistently? It feels good, definitely. It feels good, um, especially when we play on the road. The games are tougher, I believe. And then I'm glad that I helped the team, uh, like scoring, you know, getting some steals, like doing something on the court. Uh, that makes me really happy. How excited are you to play four straight games at home now? I know the first one's going to be a big one, but how much are you looking forward to playing at home? We really miss play at home. Uh, we cannot wait to play in Ras Fargo too. Uh, I think it's going to be a fun game, especially uh, tough games are coming up. And then uh, we're going to be in front of our fans. And then uh, finally, I'm going to sleep in my bed tonight. So, Thank you for it. Congrats. Mark Narducci. Hey, Ferk, um, Coach Rivers was saying about how you've been going more directly to the basket. He thought maybe before in the season you were you were maybe dribbling too much, and now you're getting to the basket. Is this something you had a talk with him about or just something you, you've taken on your own to kind of change? He is definitely telling me every day, like, you got to have straight line drives, straight, straight line drives, and then you got to make the defense uh, make some decisions. Uh, he's telling us every day, especially me, uh, he wants me to go to downhill more, especially uh, when I play pick and rolls. Definitely, uh, he's, he's telling us. Thanks. Chris Franklin. Hey, Farrakhan. Uh, since you've been in the league now, uh, how, can you describe like how satisfying it is for you now, seeing the way you're performing now from your rookie year all the way to where you're at right now, putting up 20 points off the bench, man? How does it feel? How satisfying is it for you? I've been through a lot of tough situations, you know. Um, I've been in this organization for four years, and then finally I'm glad that last two seasons I'm really showing myself and that I'm able to help this organization. Uh, and then uh, that makes me really happy, man. Like, personally, I've been through a lot of things uh, overseas here, but finally uh, I find my role, and then I'm giving something to this team. Keith Pompey. Kirk, what's what's the thing you're the most proud of the last two games? I mean, I mean you had back-to-back -back season highs, but defensively, you know, five steals, two steals. I mean, is is that the most gratifying thing for you, the defense side? I mean, uh, when I'm going into the games, I know I will score in some some ways. You know, there's some games you score two points, eight points, ten points, fifteen and twenty points, like last two games. But defensively, when people, my coaching staff, uh, my teammates talk about my defense. That makes me really proud of it, you know, really proud. So, so what did you do to improve? I mean, because you made, you know, a lot of improvement. What did you do to improve in that area? I mean, I will say this. Uh, my game is a little bit mentally, a uh, mental game. That's how I feel, you know. And uh, when I make some something good, positive on the court, that makes me uh, keep getting better and playing better. And then defensively, I just start to learn the game more. Uh, I've been here. Um, a lot enough to learn the game defense, especially because it takes a lot of time. It's a total different game. Uh, you got to be guarding better one on one. And then I think uh, I'm doing a really good job uh, scouting the uh, opponent, you know, uh, reading all the scouting reports and then just trying to be uh, in front of the people, you know.